Hi everyone. We're going to do a, an astronomy type problem with the ellipsis and some of the vocabulary you need to know is um, perihelion means the shortest distance from the planet, in this case Jupiter, to the, to the Sun. And perihelion is the shortest distance from the planet, the distance from the planet to the Sun. The mean distances from the origin to the outer por portion of the ellipse. This would be your major axis here. When we're talking about uh, ellipses, I just wrote the ellipse this way. All right, so we have to find the mean distance, the perihelion, and uh, we're given the distance from the sun to the center. We're given this information here which is uh, 23.2 million miles. So basically what we're going to do, and we also have that um, the whole A, I'm just going to call it A, but it, F helion is um, 507 million miles. So basically we're going to have to write um, an equation, and you know we're going to need our uh, A and our B and our C. So, basically, that's what we're going to do. The sun is the focus. So, basically, on this one, we already have the distance for the focus. So, let's do this. The mean distance first. So, the mean distance is you're going to take your 5. So, we're looking for the mean distance here. This little bit here. And that is 500. And just remember, it's millions of miles. So you have 507, 507, minus your 23.2. So we're just taking the whole thing, minus 23.72. And that's going to give you your mean distance. And that equals 483.8 million miles. All right. Then your P, so this is your mean, let me put that in purple. That's your mean dis distance. Now we need the, the P, the perihelion. Okay. So all we're going to do is take this amount, our, our whole distance, and subtract. So that's going to be 483.8. And these are all millions of miles again. Minus 20. 3.2 million, which gives us 460.6 millions of miles. All right, that's your P. And so A, we know that A, so the length of from here to here, this is our A, is 483.8 times 10 to the 6, or that's millions. And then, um, since A is this, and we know C is your focus, C is right here, is 23.2 millions of miles. All we have to do is find our B. And I'm going to do that on the other slide. So we know that B squared equals a squared minus c squared. So b squared equals uh, 483.8 time, um, times 10 to the 6 squared minus um, 23.2 times 10 to the 6 squared and when you clean all this up, you're going to get a B. You can put that in the calculator. I already did this. It's going to be 483.2 times 10 to the 6. All right? So that's your B. Now that you have that, all you have to do is write the equation. You have X squared over your A squared. So A is 483.2. 0.8 times 10 to the 6th squared minus your B or plus 
y squared in your B is 483.2 million. All right, equals 1. So that's your equation. And if you want to go smaller on this, you can let x and y, uh, let the units, units for x and y be millions of miles. You don't have to, but if you want to do that, you can do that. And so then it would, it looks nicer. You're going to x squared over 234062.44 plus y squared over 233524.44. Equals one. And so that's all. Thank you. Have a nice day. The next problem is going to be the exact same time problem, same type problem, <clears throat> but with Pluto. Thank you and have a nice day. Bye-bye.